is going on everybody? Mods guy 202 here today. I should not say Mods guy 202 today. Mods guy here today. And today we are back into another GTA 4 Elspeed Fire episode uh, single player. Um, I haven't posted multiplayer in a while. Um, that's because my internet's been acting up. It's been really weird. The Wi-Fi is not all that best. So I'm working on getting that fixed. So hopefully I'll be able to get into a patrol soon. Um, Anyways, today we're using this Liberty County Sheriff Patrol. I forget what I found it off of. Um, but yeah, so more of the story is we're nighttime because, and, and during the day, this thing is freaking bright. Like, even at night, it's bright. <laughs> but like, it is so nicely lit up. Just look at that. So yeah, so that's the more of the story why we're in the nighttime. But anyways, it's been quite a while since I've been in here, so just give me a little break here. But I think I remember everything. Dispatch, one Tom 16, gonna be uh, 1041 10 8 real calls. Alright, so right now, the dispatch is gonna be passing us <laughs> over details about a person with a weapon. It's gonna be on Shinnick Avenue, Colvin Street. We're gonna head on over there, code 2. Dispatch, show me 1097. Turn right. Please proceed to highlight it. Please, Alright, so we're gonna head on over here. Uh, it's a report of a person with a knife. So hopefully we can um, locate this individual. Right. And see if we can solve this yards. issue. Turn left. In 10 yards. Turn right. Looks like it's gonna be right down here. Dispatch one time 16, gonna be showing 1023 on scene. I'm gonna be out with that individual, it's gonna be South Chernock Avenue. It's gonna be an elder, elderly female carrying a pistol. I'm gonna go ahead and make contact. Hey ma'am! We're just gonna draw a gun here. Hey ma'am, can I ask you to drop that gun so you speak to me? Can I, can I speak to you? Ma'am, stop right there. Stop. Ma'am, stop. I just wanna talk to you, alright? Just drop the gun and we can talk, okay? You're under arrest, you freak! Alright. So she does have a second amendment to be carrying a weapon. But it's not the ideal thing to be doing here. Alright, ma'am, so you are not under arrest right now. Um, unfortunately, I'm just detaining you. Just for my safety and for, for everybody else's safety around us. I'm just going to go ahead and place you in my cruiser and we're going to have a chat, okay? You got any idea on you? You don't have any idea on you. Okay. Alright. So let me just go get that gun. Alright. So... Here's the deal. You do get your second amendment. You're allowed to be carrying a weapon out here. But I we, we, we received multiple phone calls about you pointing it at people. Your second amendment allows you to carry the gun in public, but not pointing at people, okay? That's 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 where that's where I have an issue with it, okay? You can't just come out here in the public and be pointing the gun at people. Just because you have it and want to show it off and everything doesn't mean you're pointing it at everyone, alright? Okay. Secondly, what's your first and last name? So I can look you up. And you have any warrants or anything like that that I should know about? Nothing. Okay. Alright, so I want you to hang tight for me. And I'm going to go ahead and get your name up. Everything up, okay? Alright, so we're just going to up here as if she gave us a name and everything. And we're going to up here as if she came back with a warrant. Alright, Lisa. So, um, here's the deal. Um... You know you have a warrant off your arrest, right? In San Andreas County? You're unaware of that. Okay. Well, it's there for not appearing in court date. So, unfortunately, I am going to have to bring you in today. Okay? Alright. So, is there anything on you that I should know about that's going to poke stick me or stab me? Nothing? Okay. Alright. Alright. So, we're going to go ahead and bring her in. Um... So we're gonna bring her in for the uh, pointing the gun at people. I was just gonna let her off with a warning with that. We're safe. 
but um, she's already going in. She's already going in for the fact of the missed court date. So I'm not gonna just go ahead and completely excuse the fact that she was pointing the gun at people. Um, the Second Amendment in the U.S. does allow you to carry a gun in public, and um, you can carry an AR-15 if you wanted to in public. Um, the only thing that you really can't carry and that you really enforce are like bazookas right. and stuff like that. Because um, I mean, that's just, I don't know, that's just something an ordinary Avenue. civilian should not have. So, if they have a bazooka and they're carrying it in public, I mean, we gotta enforce that. That's just something that an ordinary civilian just should not have. So, but she was just carrying a little Glock, um, and I didn't think. It didn't look like she was pointing at anybody when I got there, but all the all the phone calls we received uh, came back and said that she was she was pointing at people, and I had a few eyewitnesses there that uh, also saw her do it. So unfortunately, I'm gonna have to bring her in for that. So I was just gonna let her off with a warning and take and seize the weapon, but um, you know she's going in for the court date, so. Alright, this match one, one top 16, you're gonna go ahead and show me back 10-8 available for calls. If it puts up a reckless drive, we could take that. Excuse the uh, New Jersey stuff guys, I forgot, I didn't replace it since the last episode. Calculating um, route. It's gonna be a reckless drive on Raybler, right. Please and a Raybler on Delaware turn. Avenue. Dispatch, go ahead and show me 1097 code 3. So right now, dispatch just passed us details about a reckless driver, and it appears that the reckless driver is right here. Um, not too sure if the driver is under the influence or whatnot, but we're gonna go ahead and try to find out. <laughs> dispatch, I'm gonna have that vehicle. It's gonna be West Crockett Avenue. Uh, Suspect is crashing into everything. I'm gonna go ahead and attempt to stop the vehicle. Please pull Let's see if he wants to stop us. Suspect is in a vehicle. Dispatch via five. It's gonna be an active 1080 at this time. We're gonna be heading north Delaware Avenue. Suspect's gonna be in a gray four-door Viva. It's gonna be occupied times one. Uh, this is going to be Charlie Baker Baker 6532. Uh, suspect's now heading north Mohan Avenue, East Hook. I don't have a ram bar on, so I don't want to. Alright, looks like we got state involved now. Suspect's now heading north of Mohan Avenue. Avenue. In a uh, black Ubermark This guy's not stopping. Uh, he's definitely intoxicated from something. Uh, he has no awareness of what he's doing. Looks like he's got his on Avenue. 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 Speeds up about 50 miles per hour. Oh my god. That's not ideal. Hey, <laughs> 
This guy's just not stopping. Suspect headed north on Asparagus Avenue in a uh, black Ubermont Revler. Try to go for a better pit here. Suspect headed north on Algonquin Duke Expressway. It's successful. Chop, 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 chop. He's boxed. He's boxed. He's boxed. He's boxed. Get out of the vehicle now! Let me see the sheriff's office! Get out of the vehicle now! Show me your hands! Get out of the vehicle now! Step out of the vehicle now! They're gonna drag him out. Stop right there! You're gonna get tased! You don't wanna get tased, do you? <laughs> Stop! This much one tough to stand. We're gonna have Taze deployed. I'm gonna Taze deployed. Test is gonna be at gunpoint. We're gonna have him South Muncie Avenue downtown. We're gonna get him. This we're gonna have one suspect in custody at this time. Final stop, East Montauk Avenue downtown. The hell's the matter with you, man, huh? Are you intoxicated or something? Leading the police on this huge chase and everything, and just to get tased and hurt, and look where you end up. Hey, how you doing? You know how many lives you put in danger tonight? All right, well, you got anything on you that's gonna book me, stick me, stab me that I should know about? Nothing? Okay. All right, you got an ID on you? Anything in the vehicle that I should know about? <coughs> Nothing. Okay. All right, you don't want to talk to me anymore? That's fine. Alright, so he's, he's obviously he's going to jail tonight. Um, he's fled from the police multiple to multiple times. Um, he led us on the huge chase, but mo a lot of life's in danger. And um, that's just not the ideal thing to do in this, especially this city. In so. 10 yards. so you guys see what I was talking about Turn during the day? Right. So right. Wait. In 100 yards. Turn right. God, that looks so good with the sun. Available units respond to a criminal resisting arrest in Montauk Avenue. Oh, these places, them truly are nice, see? You think the same thing, you know? Excuse me. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and take him to the station. That was just really uncalled for. Um, right. Bobby just running because he had a few. If you had a few warrants or something like that, um, I'm not sure about it. The other officers, the other officers checked and they did put him under the because they were state, so I allowed them to do it. They did put him under a breathalyzer test. He was highly intoxicated with alcohol, so that's another reason why he quite didn't know what he was doing. But um, all that matter is that we were able to catch him and that no more lives are put in danger besides ours. Um, he could have really seriously injured somebody if he crashed into them or whatnot, um, or crashed into a building, something like that. Um, but all that matters is that everybody's safe and that the suspect is off the street. And I guess that's the beauty of this job. Think. All right. Dispatch one Tom sixteen. Go ahead, show me ten eight. Calls. We're gonna try to do some uh, traffic enforcement too. Um, I feel like I do a lot of just calls, 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 calls. So I'll try to do some traffic enforcement here. Let's see who's gonna be our first victim. We're gonna only take some priority ones now that we have quite. Now that we got that pursuit in, that was pretty. We'll respond to a vehicle accident. I haven't really done that. 
10-4. We just got code forwarded on that, so. Okay, he's, uh, he's just driving good because I was behind him. It's always a possibility. Something's happening. She's gonna go ahead and till they're done here. I just don't want them to get hit. Looks like an ambulance is arriving on scene now too. Oh, as they just run over that dude. All right, we'll carry on with that with it. We'll let them do this. And we'll do ours. The state, we're shared. Go ahead and uh Wow, everyone's driving good today for some reason. Usually GTA 4 they just going through everything. I'm gonna try to take one of these vehicle calls. I haven't really done them. Calculating route. An RTA that has been reported on Sing Sing Avenue. Please make a U-turn. We're safe. Okay. In 200 yards. Turn. This batch going to turn 1097. All right. So right now we're heading to a motor vehicle accident. Um, not too sure how many cars are involved, or any injuries, or if fires already on scene or whatnot. Um, but we're gonna go ahead and head on over here and see cases. Could just be a small little fender bender or whatnot. But we're gonna go ahead and just head on over to make sure everyone's okay. <laughs> That's an unusual call. Alright, <laughs> let's just pull on over here. How the fuck am I supposed to get to that? We're just gonna... We're just gonna carry on with our game. Put it that way. We'll just leave that be. Shots fired call, we'll take that one. That was something weird. Fox me 15 up subjects on Boca Juice Expressway. Oh, that's good. That's Turn left. I'm not paying attention. Right. This show me 1097. Alright, so right now we're heading to reports of sh shots fired with numerous subjects involved. Right. Um, call, call said, call 15. I'm not too sure on that, so when we get on over here, we'll check it up. Let's see, could just be some friends having some fun with airsoft guns and whatnot, but we still gotta take this as a serious matter. Um, Cause it very well could be people shooting at each other. So. So it looks like it's going to be in the airport. Close <laughs> to it. Thank <laughs> you. 
this dispatch when I'm one top 16. I got multiple shots by it. Go ahead and go spot. Holy smoke, I am in the middle of the What do I even do? a war zone out here. Get down guys, get down, get down. Check. Alright, maybe that is all of them. Just check this side. They're still looking for something. here time zone all right yeah I think that's all of them well that was something to roll up to huh it was literally like a war zone just gonna put our hair yeah, back um we'll call for EMS kind of see if doesn't know how to drive, so they're going to take a little while to get here. Alright, they're going to take, <laughs> they're not going to know how to get here. They're going to be stuck there for quite some time, so we're just going to go ahead and carry on with our day. Probably do like two traffic stops. Call that an episode. Oh, it's good to know they got the other subject. You know what? That dude. That dude was flying. Pull over! Police! That dude was flying. Shift your ass! I got a job interview! This bus, one Tom 16. 1011, it's gonna be South Stillwater Avenue, Meadows Hill, it's gonna be with a yellow taxi cab, like it's gonna be Xavier York King 3742. Okay, times one, no additional need at this time. Okay, times two, correction. Hey, hey so how's it going, Musk? Mods guy with the uh, Liberty County Sheriff's Office. You know why I'm stopping you today? 
This the reason why I'm stopping track. you back there because um on that road back there you're going awfully fast coming in this direction and then you slow down when you got in front of me. Any reason for that? May I see your ID, please? You in a rush? All right. Okay. You forgot it at home? All right. So, can I have you step out of the vehicle okay, for me, please, real quick, both of you? Um. This can't be happening. Well, I understand, ma'am, but this this is how it's gonna have to be. You got any ID on C, por favor? Put your hands on your head and don't move them. All right, hold. Okay, so, so here's the deal. You're driving without a license in your taxi, okay? That's not, that's not acceptable, okay? This is not, it's not how this is going to be. And I'm not going to let you do that because it's just, this is the law, okay? All right, so I'm going to go ahead and look up your name. I want you to hold tight here. And if you got anything that comes back that I should know about, warrants, anything like that, priors, Nothing. Okay. So hang tight. I'll be back. Right, so I'm gonna just gonna go ahead and touch up his name here. Just kind of obviate. Alright. Okay. So here's the deal. You got no warrants out, which is good. But you do got priors for driving without a license. So, I'm towing the taxi. I'm writing you a citation, and then I'm going to let you off, okay? But if I ever catch you driving without a license again, unfortunately, I'm going to have to arrest you, okay? All right. Coño, que suerte. Okay. Come on, I got oh. This Sorry. All right. We'll just act like we let him off. I didn't mean to do that. Fortunately, this is gonna get towed. I don't have the tow thing. Man. That's alright. We'll just stop here. We got towed. All right, guys. I think that's gonna do it for today's episode. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, only like. If you guys enjoyed it, don't forget to subscribe. Until next time, guys. Mods guy, out.